the surgeon will make a small skin incision in the upper chest, just below the collarbone. A pocket is then created between the skin and the tissue that covers the chest muscle. Next, the team will use instruments called retractors to hold back the skin and underlying tissue. They'll locate a large blood vessel called the subclavian vein. Using a special needle and syringe, your doctor will puncture the wall of the vein. A thin guide wire is then inserted through the needle and into the vein. Your doctor gently pushes the wire until it reaches the heart. Using an instrument called a fluoroscope, the surgical team is able to see the wire's progress through the vein and into the beating heart. Once the wire is in place, the needle is removed and a catheter, or hollow tube, is passed over the guide wire and into the heart. One or two leads are then passed through the catheter. When the lead or leads are in their proper position, the catheter is removed. Finally, the lead is connected to the pacemaker. The pacemaker is inserted into the pocket below the collarbone. and the incision is closed.